Welcome back. I had a couple of project requests. Terry wanted me to turn a female form and I had a request for a ring box. So I took care of both of them. Let's go ahead and get started. The Wood Shop is sponsored by For the first part of the inside out turning, I just clamped one end into the chuck and used packing tape on the other end. And this worked out well. Just make sure they're lined up so when you flip them around they're even. And this is the first one of these I've made, so I wasn't quite sure on proportions. So I made four sets of legs, varied the length a little bit on each of them. That way once I get the body done, I can go ahead and pick the one that looks the best.
All right, I'm gonna glue it together now. I got the bottom of the base sanded up to 600 and the hat too. So I'm gonna do that before I put any oil on those three pieces. So the legs just go up in there. And I have three more sets of legs too, so I'm gonna make a couple more of these. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find another piece of burl like this, but I will look around. I really like the way the, the, the dress came out. So I want it on had it all planned out which way I wanted to go. Just like that. All right, get that in there, in the base. Make sure it all goes together good. And I'm gonna turn it around so the sapwood there is facing towards the front because I'm gonna do Want it just like that, I think, because the hat has a little bit of sapwood on it too. And once I get the oil on it, you'll be able to see it a little better, and and uh, so they line up. But that the top goes on there, and it just enough to to lift it up, but it's not hard to get out. So I don't, didn't want to make it fit too tight. And on this, I'm going to tip it a little bit, just a little bit to the front, and a little bit uh, to the side, like that. There we go. She's eight inches tall and her dress is four inches around. I use walnut and maple burl in the little cup there that's just big enough to hold hold one ring and they can put some down on the base. I really like the way the natural edge on that dress looks there. And for the inside out turning on the legs, I've never tried to do that before. So I just kind of gave it the basic shape and then took 100 grit and tried to round them over so they didn't look like, like the stems on the wine glasses I did. But I really like the way they came out. And I have a couple more sets, so I'm gonna make a few more of these. I did a tall one too, I just did that. So I'm, uh, I didn't put a box in the top of that one, but I made the tray a little bit bigger. I need to get that glued together. I'll get that one finished. I'm gonna put them both up on Etsy. And this, uh, this one here, when I was searching for female forms, this is where I got the idea. His name is Nicholas Sarago. He's from Greece. I'll put a link down below in the description to his website so you can go check it out. Um, he did one very similar to this. It's a solid piece of wood though. It's out of olive wood, but it just uh, he does some amazing work, amazing off-center goblets. He does a lot of carving on his turnings too. He look, he works with olive wood quite a bit. So just some beautiful stuff. So thank you, Nicholas, for the idea. All right, um, I think that's it. If this is your first time here, I have a new project video every Friday. I hope to see you there. And if you haven't done so yet, please subscribe. Till next time, take care.